What are these coffins? What are these people doing? What are you doing? Why are you running side to side like a lunatic? <laughs> Hello everyone, my name's Mike and welcome back to The Order 1886. I'm gonna start chapter 3 right now, Inequalities. Let's go! We scour the district in pairs. Isabeau, you and Lafayette take the high street from the south end. Galahad and I will move in from the north. Why not give the Frenchman to Galahad? Mademoiselle doubts my intentions. I promise to remain at all times the picture of chivalry. I'd prefer to have someone more experienced looking out for me. I thought you needed no looking after. Very well. You team with Galad. Mademoiselle will perhaps one day allow me to demonstrate my skill. One day? Remember, we are entering rebel territory. The insurgents will take umbrage at our incursion into Whitechapel. Given our little discovery in Mayfair, the London Hospital should be our target. Strange to think Lycans would find sanctuary here, is it not, monsieur? You really believe the rebels are collaborating with the half-breeds? The Lord Chancellor is convinced of it. I have my doubts. Do you trust anyone, Mon General? Never accept. Always question. It's a motto that's seen me through the centuries. Stay vigilant, all of you. We can expect hot work here. Ah, quelle joie! A nest of cut purses, collaborators, and whoremongers. I knew it very differently once. The 15th day of October, District of Whitechapel. Petey gets to the hospital, all hospital undetected. That was before even my time. The city walls had yet to come up. Now you can smell white jump from I think we're pairing up with the French guy, aren't we? <clears throat> Nothing is as it used to be, Sebastian. True. The order, least of all. We're sticking together for the moment and we'll probably split up once we get into Whitechapel. We rendezvous at the hospital. Stay on your guard. Understood. Right, those guys are going that way. It's fellow Frenchy. Making plenty of noise. What's this in the desk? Anything useful or just something to look at? The ashes are still warm. Ah, so there's there's a um, people lurking around. Someone's been here recently. Which way did he go? Hello there, boys. Oh shit. Who said that? Is someone over there? Us, oh, ladies. Show us your tits! And look, monsieur. Those lovely ladies on the balcony are waving at us. Prostitutes, Marquis. Say that like it's a bad thing. Probably the best looking apple I've seen in a video game. Um, I'm gonna turn it around to this side and I'm gonna take a bite. We're gonna throw it at the guy, distract him. What are we doing? R2? Oi! It's gonna grab him. <coughs> Can I intercept this? <laughs> He's bleeding like a stuck pig, that one. Doesn't look good. He ain't getting up. Stay down, you stupid git. We're just leaving them to do that. They're not really part of anything. They're just... Okay, let's just walk past. Didn't see anything. Strange place. I mean, the atmosphere in this is really good. It's just not that interactive or... It's very um, linear as well. What's this? Is that anything that we need to look at? Is that just nothing? What are these coffins? What are these people doing? 
What are you doing? Why are you running side to side like a lunatic? <laughs> Hideous slums, some no more than crannies of obscure misery. Long hours in factories, only to be paid a pittance and told by your masters to be grateful for a few bob a week. Children work to the bone in the Black Haller coal mines, while the captains of industry feast from silver bowls. Is this the England we want? No! What must we do? He's spotted. Let's move. That's right. Brothers and sisters, fight! Join our cause! Down with the so we, we didn't even get to the hospital undetected. We've kind of been spotted already. Down with the Queen! Down with Empire! She's dead! Because of you! Oh, fuck. <laughs> Never hit a lady. Um, it's gonna break his arm, I guess. Yes. Dislocate his shoulder. Smash his skull in. Didn't care to dirty your aristocratic hands. You okay, my lady? It's all right. There's no need to be afraid. How could I have known he was a ripper? He was just another bloke. He killed another one last night. I didn't know. Leave her be, monsieur. I didn't, didn't know. Suffer. Don't worry. You're safe now. Was that Jack the Ripper then? Oh, I'm stuck. Okay. We should head through this door. If you say so. This is a lockpicking device. Ooh, fancy. Hold L2 to drive the air cylinders, exposing the tumbler pin position. While holding L2, slowly rotate the right stick until the vibration diminishes at the shear line. Press R2 to engage the pin. Um, like that. Yeah, okay, when the, when the pin goes up, like that, you press R2. Oh, that was wrong. Hey, I think I yeah we did it. Okay, it's kind of cool. It's different, isn't it? Oi! There's no weapons allowed in the establishment. You want to stay, you leave it here. Bien sûr, monsieur. As a matter of fact, we were just looking for the code closet. Give it here. And a fun, governor. At ease, monsieur. A quick reconnaissance of the premises seems imperative. <clears throat> so we've lost our weapons. We've still got a knife on our back, though. So I guess we should... You could slash a guy if you want to. Another time. I can show you things you've never seen before. I don't doubt it. I'm expecting to see tits in the next couple of minutes now. If there's going to be tits in this game, it's going to be now. We have to find a way out of here quickly. I have just a thing, monsieur. If one of you ladies would reach into my pocket. Give it here, love. Is it sufficient, monsieur? <laughs> More than sufficient, I'd say. Upstairs, then, if you please. It's a good job he brought his money, isn't it? His cash. Are you about ready, love? You won't forget this, I tell you. Oh, was that tits? Or oh, almost... I want to see if you can see some tits. <laughs> see how good they look in this graphics. This way, love. Get in here. Oi! Here! What are you 
up to? You're in the wrong room. Where's the little frog gone? He's in there. With his friend. Mm, that didn't go too well, did it? Get out of there. Yep, tits. Oh! Hello? <laughs> Oh, we can see dicks now as well. Lovely. Oh, he's covered himself up. He's got some dignity. So we're still going to find a way to the hospital. Can we go out the back door? Is this a balcony? See if we can get out of here. And there's a rooftop that we can climb on, I guess. Let's try this. Um, which way are we going? Doesn't look like we're going down that way. Maybe we are going that way, jump across the ledge. Yep, hang on there. Can we get on top of the roof? Looks like we might be going down actually. Yeah. Go underneath the window. Get your weapon. Let's go. Lafayette. I think the widescreen like letterbox is a bit much in this game. They don't need that. They're trying to make it look like a cinematic experience, but it kind of you know remove some of your vision a little bit when you're behind cover and stuff. Looks like we've stirred the nest. Keep a look out, Marquis. People are getting a bit suspicious now. What's that over there we can pick up? It's one of the collectibles in it. We won't bother listening to it because we interfere with the story, I think. I don't even know what this is. What am I doing? Am I giving him a passageway so he can get across? I oh, know, so we can. I can jump back out now, outside now, and then we'll get across the rooftop. I think. I think that was blocking our path. Let's check. If there's anything else to do in here? There's a door over here. Yeah, we can't use that. Right, so let's jump back across there, and we're gonna jump on this ledge now. Go across. Open the window. I feel like we've just completely gone off track. We're meant to be going towards the hospital. Just going like zigzagging through buildings. Oh, we got a gun out now. Can we do stealth kill on these guys? Two shorts for knights and one long for bobbies. Does it matter? Just keep your eyes open for either. Well, I mean, if it's night. I want to see these guys split up and we can take them out stealth. So we can go across this side. Get a bit closer. And the same for bobbies. Nah, if it's just a few, we'll shoot them and be dumb. And if it's more? I don't know, we'll bloody shoot them too. Oh sake. shit. Okay. You That's like a double shot. Yeah, duelist revolver. It shoots two shots. Oh, give me that gun. Right. We need to find another way to the hospital. So we got a rifle now as well. We only brought because those guys took the guns off us, didn't he? And this revolver was from that guy's, but that guy's room. So we can pick up more stuff here. We can have a rifle, carbine, or I think that's a machine gun. What's this one? That's a rifle. I'm gonna go for the rifle just to get some like one hit kills, you know, at long range, and we'll use the pistol at short range. Where are we going over this ledge? Here we go. Can we just jump down? I think we can, right? So we're still going towards the hospital. Huh? Okay. Whee! Trop facile, hein? <laughs> I sense that we are not welcome here. Keep your eyes open. We don't want to create any further commotion. So we're back here again. 
God did not save this queen. Move! It was kind of a waste of time going inside the brothel and back out around the corner and back end up where we were again. That Fight through the rebel ambush. Right. What are they going to aid? Ow, fuck! Well, how did he hit me? Keep my head down. Oh, shit. Let's get a shot on this guy. He didn't get him. Okay, now we, let's get the sniper out of the way. He's dead now. We can focus on the rest of them now. Ah, oh, fuck. Just hope he can't hit my head. As you can see, he flashes when he's about to shoot you. It's a little bit like Time Crisis. <laughs> oh, no way! Get this guy a grenade in the window. Actually missed. They bounced off the wall and went back down there. Rebel down. Take the street. So I think he's going for the streets. I'm going for the inside. Where are we going? Oh, the door won't the open. There's a guy here. Let's take him out of the melee. Yeah. Oh, I really like the um, the environmental kills on this with the melee. It works really well. What's black sight? Press L1 to toggle black sight when the meter is available. I don't know what that is. Is the meter at the bottom right? Do you press it while you're aiming? What the hell's black sight? All right, so we're going to continue anyway. They blocked the way. Through the building. This gun's amazing. Is that a guy in there? Can't really tell. Explosive barrel. Yeah. Did some damage. This is more exciting. When our bullets crap. Let's see if we can go inside. Pick up some bolts there. Understood, monkey. Monsieur, shotgunner. Shit, I missed the barrel. Can't really see over the walls that well with the cover system. Right Ow, shit. Get him. Yeah, knee in the face. I should have picked up a shock on here. I don't think that's that, that good for the position I'm in. I need to get down there, I think. Is this infinite spawns? Because this is like loads of enemies. Let's get down there. Oh fuck. Didn't see that. Am I down? Revive yourself. I didn't know that was a thing. Ow. There's a lot of enemies, isn't there? What the fuck? I 
think we just need to get through them. Like, push. It's like never-ending enemies. Let's just push through. See if we can get up there. We can't climb up there, shit. Can we not climb up there? Come on. No? Really? Alright, let's continue. We need to keep moving and get off the streets. Okay, so this whole time I was sitting back trying to pick them all off and we had to actually uh, push forward and just they, then they'd stop coming. Where are we going? And we're going to push this, are we? It's a little like Call of Duty, the combat scenes where it's infinite waves of enemies until you push past them and they stop spawning. Alright guys, this chapter's quite long so I'm going to split it into two parts. See you guys in the next part, we'll finish off this chapter. Bye!